This is Flashback Frank of the Rutherford County Historical Society. Did you know there was once a Murfreesboro newspaper produced and edited by a local African-American woman? Her name was Mary Ellen Vaughn, and man, was she ever a force of nature. Mary Ellen Vaughn was born in 1893 near Montgomery, Alabama. She moved to Murfreesboro as a young lady and became a force in Rutherford County's civil rights movements beginning in the first half of the 20th century. Miss Vaughn was certainly an educated, talented, and entrepreneurial woman, she earned a bachelor's degree from Tuskegee Institute, studied at the Chicago Business College, eventually in 1950, at the age of 57, earned her master's degree from Tennessee A&I College, known today as Tennessee State University. Miss Vaughn simply never stopped learning. She was also a nurse, working in the 1920s to improve public health in rural areas of Rutherford County. Miss Vaughn established an African-American newspaper named the Murfreesboro Union in 1920, and even established Vaughn's Training School from 1933 to 1951, once located at the intersection of Vaughn Street and South Highland Avenue in Murfreesboro. Miss Vaughn's Training School provided basic and vocational education for black adults in the community, teaching basic subjects in addition to vocational courses such as typing, cosmetology, and sewing. The price to attend? Only 25 cents a week. You see, Miss Vaughn's Training Academy was established due to the requirements of literacy just to cast your vote. In her words, she wanted to, quote, elevate the race to high ideas, to lift them up and encourage them to live better lives. Enjoy this story and 2,000 other stories concerning Rutherford County history by visiting www.rutherfordcounty.com.